Well, that might be on the video. <laughs> That'd be okay. Oh, my gosh. Okay. Are Hi, we on? I'm, oh, my. <laughs> Hi, I'm Sandy. I'm Dave. From Superior Scenics. Nice to see you. And we're here to talk a little bit about our, our company and what we can do to help you with your hobbies. So when we first got started with our business, Dave decided that he wanted to sell trees. So you can see in the background, he uh, used a lot of trees on our layout and he felt that he could produce these and sell them. So that's where we started. Yep. So you can see some of the trees packaged here. We start with as small as a one inch tree and we have one and a half. Then we go up from that to two inch, three inch, four inch, five inch, all the way up to uh, 15 inch trees. The largest ones that we're showing here are the 12 inch trees. There are two in a package here. Uh, depending on the size of the tree, the number in a package can vary. You get to 15 inch, they're just a single because the, the tree is four inches at the base going up. So that, that takes a six inch bag all by itself. So that was just a recent introduction uh, to the uh, stable of plants, if you or trees, if you will. Um, it was some guys who run uh, O-Scale asked if I would do larger trees. And also recently, uh, people who do farm dioramas. We just had a guy, I uh, was a custom order for farm dioramas and I was just amazed. So yes, this is what started us. Um, back, how many years ago was that? Somewhere in the neighborhood of 15 years. Yeah, back there. So yeah, we, we started out, uh, our last name is Homan. So our business started out as H.O. Man. And I didn't think that was a real good idea because I figured people would I think. I thought it was a great idea. <laughs> it was neat, you know, but I was afraid that people would think we were HO scale only. Stereotype. And, and our products can be used on any scale. Yes. They really aren't any specific scale until you put them into place. So our trees can be used on anything from Z N scales all the way up to your larger O S scales, uh, Dow houses, farm dioramas, any 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 hobby. Um, but that's where we got started. Uh, and sorry, hon, I was right. People were walking by. Oh, now that's H O scale. So we changed our name and we feel that we have a superior product. So we changed our name to superior scenics. We did that back in 2011, September of 2011, we became superior scenics, Yes. but we have been in business uh, longer than that. Yes. What's interesting about the products that we produce, and I guess I get to toot my horn on this one, because what's fun is meeting the customers. And, but no, we get to meet the customers, and customers will come to us constantly and tell us exactly how they like our product and how, you know, they were amazed on the, on the quality. And that, that really does make you feel good at the end of the day to be told that. I'm not, was, I wasn't really expecting to hear something like that ever, but it was kind of fun to hear people say mm -hmm. what they think. And, and if you've been at shows and dealing with uh, crowds, they're not ever shy about telling you exactly what they think about your product or anything they're above. So, but Dave's had his layout for, he's been involved in the model railroads forever. Since he was a kid, he was interested in the trains. And when we finally were able to uh, utilize the basement for the layout, he has several uh, water features on his layout. Uh, do you have any idea how many? There's got to be in excess of 10, isn't there? No, I think there's about six. Oh, I think it was more than that. Um, I don't know. We'll, we'll have to find them all and see if we can do a count someday. But anyways, anybody that came over really liked his lakes. So I suggested that he start making lakes, that we can sell those. A lot of people are afraid to uh, attempt doing a lake. Uh, a lot of people do a really good job of them. So there's both ends of the spectrum on yes. people that would like to have water on their layouts don't know how to go about it or are more than willing to try. Uh, we have heard some horror stories from that yes, too. Yes, yes. Uh, as, as people set their um, table up and they'll tell you, well, my table's level. And I can honestly tell you for exact, that's not true. 
Level on a level is not level. Put water on a level table and watch it move. If you put a little soap with it and it watch it go away, it, it will meander. Same with this stuff. Uh, you find a pinhole, it will find it and it will be on the floor. I've heard that horror story just too many times. So some guys, hey, works great and I love it because I've seen some absolutely phenomenal pictures that guys have done. But going forward, this is what we produce. We have how many varieties? We have 16, what we would call kind of like cookie cutter styles that we produce over and over and over. And it, within those 16 varieties, and we plan on expanding our choices as time goes by, but out of those 16, we offer eight different sizes at this time and plan on doing larger ones as well. So out of all that, we've got about 128 selections on yeah. styles and sizes that you can choose from at this time. If you go to our website, Mm -hmm. and you see our website and you see a, a lake like this and you like it for whatever reason you like the waves um, we have a stock number on the back that will give you the information on that and we'll be more than happy to fill that order for you a lot of people ask why we have some that are the shiny lake like this and then you've got the ones with the waves so what you, the benefits that you get from the very shiny ones like this, like a calm lake would give you, uh, if you think of like your mountain lakes, there's a lot of reflection yes. from trees in the surrounding area yes. and it acts like a mirror. You're gonna get that with a lake that's smooth. Um, the ones with the waves, you've got that wind, you've got that ripple effect. So it's just a preference choice as far as that goes. If you have a lake alongside trackside, uh, Guys, you'll know um, reflection is kind of a neat thing, so you'll see your train actually reflect off the side of the waterway, which just kind of gives it a really neat um, perspective as far as the way it looks. But when you start adding features like the trees, the water, and things like that, that's going to change your entire outlook of, of your layout a hundredfold every time you start doing this. It's amazing the feedback we get from people on what they have done and what they've accomplished. Again, go to our website. You can see exactly what people have been doing with our product because I put- On our Facebook page. I'm sorry, Facebook don't mean page. Enough, yes. it's on the Facebook page. On the page. Facebook page, yes, sorry. Anyways, she's right again. So anyways, <laughs> um, but no, but um, absolutely outstanding um, responses on that. We've got some uh, really, really nice custom work that we've done for uh, individuals. Um, and it's been one was the largest one was a 19 foot long river um, custom pricing is exactly the same as our regular um, pieces so it's per square inch and that's how we price everything so um, going forward okay as we've added to our product lines from there we decided to uh, bring in some of the farm type supplies so we started doing the hay bales and the silage bags and loads for uh, like the trucks the trucks yes yep there Sorry. we go and if you have ever seen going down the road and you're going like what is this that's a giant size pot pl or pot marijuana stick or if you want okay. a joint how about that but anyways it's not <laughs> so let's look at it this way but if you've ever seen silage bags farmers have alongside the road or along fence lines just always understand there's never been a straight silage bag ever so if you take one and they are very flexible you put them down there and along the track and along their farmers fields and they will follow the hills they'll follow the you know the fence lines I have one that's ripped open so you can see it like you know the farmers working out of the silage bag for spills just add some more greenery around the base of it and that's that we have multiple sizes of round bales we have them also stacked like this I don't have one sitting out here right now but you uh, can actually get those from us and if you want stacks sitting in your uh, uh, farm area or wherever we have those as well so from there, uh, what we could do is show some of the waterways that you have on your layout to show what a finished product can look like when it's set in place. Yep, because when you see this, wait till the magic happens. Hi, welcome back to our layout. 
Uh, we've had a very good day so far showing off what we can do for you. And with that in mind, take a look, see at the waterway and see that there are no waves on this uh, lake on my layout. And the reason for that is if you're looking for wave action, don't, don't look at this particular lake. What I'd like you to look at is the smooth clarity of that water, which is giving you a nice reflection value of the engine that's right there. That is really a dynamic look. Uh, a lot of people really appreciate that. Um, so what I'm trying to do is build something for you that you can really make your layout pop or whatever your, um, I guess if you will, um, project is. So with all that being said, Let's go on further down the uh, layout and take a look at some of the other things that we have for you. Yeah, all right, so here we are with another water feature on the layout. And what we hear from a lot of customers is, I don't have the space for anything like that. Lakes don't always have to be large. They can be just small ponds alongside your track like this one is right here. We have a lake that's probably only about two inches wide by three to four inches long. Uh, Dave has another area in a yard that is probably about a one inch by maybe eight or nine inches long that runs alongside a track. So if you take a look around your layout or your diorama, uh, if you want a waterway, I'm sure there's probably some place you can work it in. If we don't have the specific shape or size that you're looking for, all you need to do is let us know. We can get a template from you and we can build a custom waterway for you. So get in touch with us. Okay, as we mentioned earlier, Dave has a wet area along the tracks in his yard. This is it here. And as our lakes come in a lot of different colors, this one is a darker color with some hints of green to it. So this is just another idea of where you can fit in a waterway in your layout. So, again, just some more ideas for you. <laughs> We're back. And now you guys get to see what other things we can do for waterways for you. And this one here has been on the table for, I'll bet, 25 years, I think. And then taking a look at it, it looks just as good as the day it got installed. So, hence, if you want something really, really good uh, here at Superior Scenics, we can make anything that you would like and so um, just kind of playing with it a little bit get a little crazy a little wild with rock and logs and things like that that's what's fun I mean I'll do anything for anybody it's it's just fun stuff if you got a uh, wild imagination we can build it if you want a car in the lake and sinking I can do it and oh I smile okay and I've been told to smile sorry but <laughs> anyways I guess I'm too serious but um, I think the trees give a good reflection on on the lake you know you can see all the the details so coming up with ideas is not a hard thing so I'm glad that we can help you we'd like to thank you for taking the time to view the videos we appreciate your your time uh, time is very valuable to most people so we do appreciate that if you have any questions feel free to give us a call email us Give us a text message, whatever. We'd be happy to get back with you. But again, thanks for your time. You bet. Thank you. You. Look at you. Look at what? Oh, that. Hi. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> I got Alzheimer's disease. Oh, God. Are you taping? Okay. Liar. <laughs> <laughs> My employer. Did I send that to you? Oh God, no, that was hilarious. That was hilarious. I just got silly that day, mm -hmm. dancing in front of the door. God, that, that was fun, but wow. The owner of the place was in hysterics in the office. Unreal. You're not taping, you are. So, are we on? We are on. Well, Thank you for coming and taking a tour of my layout, my wife's layout, at Superior Scenics. We didn't do a tour. What? We didn't do a tour. We didn't do a, a tour. A tour would be walking around. Oh. Thank you for checking out Superior Scenics and our products. Well, thank you for t checking us out. 
That's All not. Right. That don't sound just, good. That don't. Let, just, let just her. Stop. Let just her stop. handle this. <laughs> you say fine. You're talking to customers. So. I'm talking to customers. Yeah, talking oh to customers. God, help me. Hi. Reflection. I want to see the engines. I want to see the people. That's what I want to see. Peeping, aren't you? <laughs> oh my God. Anyways, <laughs> the, oh, All right, come on. What? Just what? What? Why about the lakes again? Why is it so dynamic? Having a lake that is, oh, a hill. 